that minute and a half of, you know, as, as everything you got, you know, nothing left. You know, you're shaking. You're, you're just, you know, I'm still, you know, the adrenaline's still running through my blood. I'm just having fun and doing exercise. You're in the hands of the starter. You're in the hands of the starter. It's a good aerobic activity, and I've met a ton of just awesome people that I get to spend my days with as often as I feel like coming out for practice. It's filled a little niche in my life. Get up off your rear end and do something. You'll appreciate it the older you get. Blazing Paddles is a club dragon boat racing team. Um, there are different levels of people within the team. There's people who take it much more competitive than others. Some people are just out here recreationally. But the goal is that we are one team out there on the same boat paddling in sync to be as good as we can. So a dragon boat is very similar to what a Viking boat would look like. Um, there's two different sizes. There's what we call a mini and then a large. These boats that we're going to be using for this race in T.Y. Park uh, are minis. So there's 10 people in the boat, and there's a steerer and a drummer. The drumming is going to indicate for us when we're supposed to be hitting the paddle into the water. You get in the boat, and the drums, and the excitement, and you know, it's for the team, and it's, it's, a, it's a rush. And when you're done, you're spent. You know that when you come off that water, it's like, you know, I couldn't have, I couldn't have gave any more. I gave it all I had. When I was done with that race, I couldn't breathe, you know. When racing gets in your blood, you just gotta, you gotta race to, to live. <laughs> it, to me, it's been testing myself because I'm not the youngest member on the team and uh, I, am, I am really tickled pink that at my age, I could do this. I'm 60. I'm, no, oh geez, I was 61 last week. We've got people from 19 to say 75. I'm 72 plus years old. Well, that makes me pretty old on the team, but, uh, you know, I'm in great shape. I can keep up with the younger guys, so as long as I can, I'm going to keep doing it. Um, all walks of life, we've got lawyers, students, um, people who are retired, nurses, teachers, you name it. Um, I started probably early August. Wasn't sure I was going to like it, and I did it mostly for the exercise. I found out after coming to a couple of practice that it's much more than exercise. This is a true team. Everybody is involved. It's a great time when you're out here. We paddle hard, but we have fun. Typically in South Florida, it's beautiful weather, so it is a year-round activity that we're able to do, in which it's just a, it's just a way to be, as corny as this will sound, at, you know, with one with nature um, out there in the water. We have two practices a week that are at night, and this time of year they're all in the dark. We don't go out on the intracoastal at night only during the day because we don't have lights on the boats. But at night we go out on the lake, and it's just beautiful. The stars are out. You see the planes passing overhead. You see the backdrop of the city all lit up. So we end up seeing the sun go down, and we're out there, and there's stuff in the water. You know, you see big splashes all around you, and, and you know, there is crocodiles out there. <laughs>